Hello and welcome, I'm Anthony Hudson. We're coming to you from the SCG. You're with us today for an exhibition match between Sydney and Collingwood. Pre-season matches are great opportunities to try out new tactics and set plays, but they're also vital for building momentum into the season proper. The skipper leads their team out onto the field. Joined by Daniel Harford. Great to have you along, Half. How do you see this one unfolding? Good to be here, Hutto. It's hard to pick a winner. This is a tough one to tip. I've landed with the home team, but I wouldn't be at all surprised if it goes the other way. It should be a beauty. Fair enough, Half. Thanks for that. The umpire and the two captains are ready for the toss. We've been looking forward to this one all week, and now the moment has arrived. Rucks go at it. Warner gets his hands on it early. Good for the confidence. Goulden, probing ball. Maynard mops that one up. Can they get something going? Grundy cuts it off. Great play. It's a poor entry, a waste really. Clever kick, the pies. Have got out of jail. Maynard. Markov. His field kicking is normally first rate. Dugowie. Delightfully done. They'll sweep this ball forward. Elliott. Who's at home? Hamlin is there to save the day. He's completely shanked it. Parker. Forced to go long down the line. No one can mark. And a moment for the players to catch their breath. Gary Lyon is here. Gaz, what are your thoughts on what we've seen so far? Oh, there's a bit of niggle in this one early. A couple of players already unhappy with some attention off the ball. Mills, Goulden, they've worked it well. Markov at halfback cuts them off. He's generally a good kick. Dugowie, that's an aggressive handball. Dacos, solid tackle. Maynard, Grundy making his claim for the Golden Fist Award. Parker. A model of consistency. Goulden in some space on the wing. Just waiting for the right moment to press go. Warner met solidly. McLean, he ran into a brick wall. Goulden gets the kick away. Side bottom, got a fist in. McDonald wins a hard ball. Heaney, it's there. He might want to tighten up on him. They gave him too much space on that occasion, and he made the most of it. The Swans have put the first on the board quickly. Grundy smashes it out of there. Adams honors the lead. Searching kick. Punched away. You can't question his commitment. Goes long. Cox. Good hands. Frampton. They're a big chance here. Elliott. If he can nail this first shot at goal, he might just be in for a big day. Grundy wins the contest and can relieve the pressure. Out wide with the kick. Campbell with a chance to run. It's a high ball. Dacos went bang. And we'll have a throw in. Thoughts so far, Gaz? Both coaches have clearly planned thoroughly to take away each other's strengths. And so far, we've got a dour struggle. Grundy looking for territory. Mills is cool under pressure. Knew the tackle was coming. They'll compete inside the 50. Quainor with the big fist. Going at his first. And he's got it. 
the swans have had a great start. Their energy is terrific. Removing the ball well and hitting the scoreboard. The Pies have been slow out of the blocks. Cameron showing his skills. Dugowie, Dacos, Marks. Will he go the bomb? To break the duck, that will have to wait. The finish let down some good play. I think he had more time than he thought. Back into play. Hamlin, Lloyd, couldn't get an effective disposal. They've put themselves under pressure. Can he find a teammate? Pendlebury takes the responsibility, just needs to finish. Finish he does. If you turn the ball over there, you've got to expect to pay the price. Good match so far. Punch clear. He's besieged. Mills kicks inside the forward 50. McLean is the man on the spot and is marked. It's one of those ones that should be kicked, but it's amazing how often players miss them. Kicking for his first. Moore went bang. Rushed over, and now they can reset. Away he goes. Quainor tasked with the kick in. Normally delivers. Cameron had his name written all over it. Can he hit a target? Rampy spoils. Dacos hunting the footy. Lipinski. He's been busy so far. Majacek loves these situations. He had prior opportunity. This might be a chance for the high flyers. McDonald. Good looking kick. Adams makes position, delivers a long ball. Defence 101 there, Heaney needs help. He just dropped it. Dacos, desperate to win it back. Rampy takes an excellent grab. Doesn't often waste it. Campbell, he's made a hot start to this match. Frampton is calm in a crisis. Dacos, happy to be patient and wait for an opening. Kicks to half forward. No one can mark. Crisp leading by example. Schiltz. He's gone. No easy exit. They'll need to be more careful than that. Adams in some space now. Parker. The Swans showing some good signs early. Cunningham picking their way through. Campbell. The aerialists will battle for this ball. McLean uses the body well. That's skillful. It looks a well oiled forward line. They've hit the ground running, and a goal here will give them a handy break. From the impossible angle, it's not impossible for him. This is exactly what they would have hoped for early in the match scoreboard pressure. The Swans have made a dominant start. Cameron got his palm to it. Dugowie, crisp, at centre half forward. The defence is disorganised. That's great footy. He doesn't miss many, so you wouldn't think this would pose any problems. Touch and go. Better ball movement on that occasion allowed them to open up that opportunity in front of goal, and they've got full reward for it. One kick game again. The big men fly. Dacos, crisp. He'll feel that one. What's he got on offer? The distance is the only problem. McCartan read it like good defenders do. Ignoring the corridor for now. Pendlebury couldn't mark, so he brings it to ground. Mills blasts away. No one can mark. Amati cops some unwanted attention. McAdooney, alarm bells are ringing. Sweeping handball. He's run into trouble. Mills, it's no place for the faint-hearted. The umpire whistles for a ball up. Grundy, the winner there. Mills goes goalward, and he's off target. 
If they can keep running and taking the game on, there's no reason why they can't create lots of opportunities in front of goal. Back into play. Frampton pushes into space and receives the footy. He might have thought about the corridor. Adams, crunching tackle. Campbell has it now on centre wing. The kick is a poor one. He doesn't waste many. Who's front and centre? Schiltz. It's a tough game. Dacos. Degoe. That might have been dropping the ball. Papley gets to it first. McLean. Bangs it long. Frampton saves the day. The Swans forcing them out wide. Grundy intercepts on centre wing. Looking to extend this margin. How went bang. Moore. A chance to clear now. You can't afford to do that too often. Dacos gets in the way. Gets his kick despite the heat. Grundy wins it back. Great mark. The Pies have denied them the corridor. Heads towards half forward. Good disciplined defence. And out it goes. What are your thoughts, Gary? The Swans set themselves to start well and they've done that. They look in good nick. Cameron with the tap to Goey. Pendlebury uses the non-preferred. And they're away. Towards half forward with the kick. McCreary. That's got a sting. Rampy in the right spot at the right time. Good thinking and good execution too. That might attract a pack. Unable to get it inside 50. The Swans guarding the corridor. Adams read it well on centre wing and can pump them back into attack. No one can mark. Frampton leading from the front. Heads towards the half forward flank. Out bodies his opponent and took a ripper. Open goal square. Which way will it bounce? Loy got to the drop zone. Penetrating ball. McInerney. Good kick. Grundy has found some space. Papley. The Swans look sharp early. McDonald marks it centre half forward. Mills. Parker spills out in the tackle. He's gone. He had plenty of time. Kicks to centre wing. Hill. Pendlebury. Murphy. Dacos. They need a mark. No one can mark. Loy. A good kick here and they'll be in business. Gets up high and manages to hold on. Sensational grab. Greg Williams would have been proud of that one. The Swans moving the ball well. Going for territory. That's an impressive mark. This is what he gets paid to do. Kick these goals. Goal coming up. The Swans are really attacking the contest and looking dangerous when they get the ball forward. So the underdogs throwing down the gauntlet. You can see their belief growing. Dacos. He's done brilliantly. Chris works hard to present. Can he be the fire star? Dugowie has it within range. This is an opportunity to settle some anxieties and get their teeth into the contest. They like it behind the goals. He's got it. Well, that was a fantastic passage to play, and it got the reward it deserved. Goal for goal. Good close match unfolding. Cameron with the tap to Goey. He stopped in his tracks. Dacos. Cox on a lead. Crisp. It's a big kick. Is it big enough? It's amounted to nothing. Goes very wide. Mills with a chance to relieve the pressure. Quality delivery by foot. The Swans look well drilled. Warner has found some space at halfback. Mills gives it everything. Murphy spoils. Blakey. One quarter down. It's been entertaining so far and there's little in it on the scoreboard. Time to check in with Gary. Not a lot on the highlights reel so far. It's been dour, but some of the tackling and other defensive acts have been great to see. The defensive side of the game has come a long way, even in the past 10 years. Every player on the field has to think defensively now, or they don't play. I'm inclined to agree. Thank you, Gaz.
Cameron wins it down. Degoe honors the lead. What a game he's having. Chris sets sail for home and he is delivered. On the board with his first, that will boost his confidence. The Pies will not go away. Cameron, the winner there. He's set upon. Bit of a nothing kick. Lipinski with a chance to run. He can put them in front. Sadly, he's astray. He's missed a couple now. Might just bring a few doubts into his head. Back into play. That's well played. Some indirect ball movement here. The Swans are out of trouble. That'll go close to the line. Warner. Kicks to space. The kick was centimetre perfect. Well, look at the distance on that hand pass. Who was he aiming for? He's hit up the lead. Warner goes at goal, but I think that's going the wrong side of the stick. It's a behind. He's off. Maynard to bring it in. They'll contest in the centre square. Cameron. That's good vision. Frampton working hard and being rewarded. They've opened them up here. Can anyone get to the drop zone? Spud Frawley would have loved that one. What are your thoughts, Gaz? The Swans are playing great footy and I can't see any reason why they can't go on to win this. Punch clear. Row bottom. Good penetration on the kick. Turned over on centre wing. Tumbles a punt towards the boundary line. He just keeps racking up disposals. Chris. Dacos. Kicks laterally. Time for the crummers to go to work. Rampy loves the hard stuff. What can they muster from the back half? Brings it out wide. Cunningham presents in space. That's not ideal. Dacos spoils. Crisp. Schiltz receives a clever hand pass. Pops. That one was always his. This for the lead for the first time today. He kicks the goal. He had the opportunity to put them in front. That's exactly what he's done. Lovely finish. The match has been flipped on its head. Good ruck work. Dacos in the thick of it as ever. Mills has brought his own ball. Frampton spoils. Campbell. Florence attracted a crowd. That's close. He liked it off the boot. They did well to construct that shot at goal, but the inability to convert really let them down. Maynard with the footy. Moore can keep it moving. And they're away. Frampton. The Pies are red hot at the moment. Dacos. Grundy takes an excellent grab. Can they keep the footy this time? The coach will start pulling out hair in a minute. Lipinski on centre wing has marked. Frampton. Good vision there. The Pies can build something here. Dacos. There goes the kick inside the 50. Majacek has a vice-like grip. This will give them some breathing space. Heads for home. It's close. What does the goal umpire say? Those are the kinds of opportunities you really need to take. Blakey heads wide with the kick in. Cunningham marks in the back pocket. Degoe went bang. Florence, Warner. Just try to get it forward under pressure. Quainor spoils. Campbell, terrific tackle. Parker, he's wrapped up. It's not the best kick. Has he done enough? They moved that ball beautifully indeed. They're hard to defend at their skillful best. The Swans in front now. Cox slaps it out. Sideball 
He'll be sore in the morning. This is promising. Mitchell, can he give them the lead? No, he can't. Seemed like the defenders got a bit lost there and they're lucky not to give up a goal. Blakey with the footy. The kick is precise. What can they generate? Markov clears the area. Goulden, Mills, that's a bruising tackle. The umpire will have it. Cox wins the hit out. Parker, Goulden throws it on the boot. Adams. No one can mark. McInerney. It's a high kick, a real rainmaker. No one can mark. Dacos. No easy exit. Quainall takes the hand pass. The Pies have got out of jail. This is good ball movement. Kicks inside the forward 50. Cox. That's a big play. Can he impose himself on the match? It's a waste of a promising build-up. Warner pushes into space and receives the footy. Florence, Adams. He's everywhere at the moment. Moore, spoils. Markov, crisp. Dishes it off. Murphy closed him down. That's an uncharacteristic mistake. McInerney, plenty of heat in this game. Does well under pressure. Quainall tries to spike it out of the danger zone. Lots to analyse, Gaz. What stands out? Football's a game of mistakes, and both sides are making plenty. The key is where you make them and what the damage is. Parker. The distance is the only problem. Moore. Read it like good defenders do. Side bottom. Working hard and presenting well. Maynard. Thought his way through it. Murphy. Gives some ground with the handball. He's so clean with the footy. Dugowie on centre wing. Pendlebury. They've got time to put the kettle on. No one can mark. That's not a mark. This deserves a goal. Dugowie can just about finish it himself. Alarm bells are ringing. To break the deadlock with a lead by six or one. He hasn't kicked it very well. McCartan wins it back. Great mark. Goes laterally. Outbodies his opponent and took a ripper. No short options, so he'll roost it long down the line. Gathers it cleanly on the wing. Warner makes the kick look okay. They cannot keep him quiet. Campbell drops into the hole and marks. Already got one today. This will be a close thing. That's an opportunity gone begging. You back him in more often than not from there. Quainall with the footy. Frampton. He's got under that one. Thumped away. Adams couldn't get a disposal. Lipinski. Elliott. Marks on centre wing. Chris. Towards full forward. Mills with a terrific mark deep in defence. They'll bide their time. Blakey has found some space. Goulden. He's got an option in the centre square. Rampy. Cox intercepts on centre wing. Hand pass cut off. Parker. Delivers to centre half forward. Good thinking and good execution too. McDonald had his name written all over. Straight in front, should not miss. This should be a goal, no problem. When that first one goes through the middle, it really helps to clear your mind of niggling little doubts and anxieties. Two goals each for the quarter. Rucks go at it. Dugowie, he's lost it. Parker, no one can mark. McInerney. Three in a row coming up. What a patch they're having. A real opportunist goal there. He doesn't need a lot of the footy to make an impact. The Swans have been impressive so far. There could be an upset brewing. The two big men do battle. Dacos is a clearance beast. Side bottom. He's caught. 
Hill. He might have thought about hand passing. Met solidly. Lipinski. It's a goal. It's always good for the confidence to see that first shot go straight through. The Pies attacking it right up to their more fancied opponents. Cox wins it down. Dacos, Crisp, heads for full forward. Mitchell has it within range. He's not on the board yet. That should change here. He's normally dependable, and he is this time. Showing exactly why they want the ball in his hands. The margin's back to just a point. Grundy wins it down. Adams, Pendlebury in the center square. This is promising. Punched away. Hamlin will tidy up. Mills, that's good work rate. Goulden is a real pocket rocket. Goes long to half forward. No one can mark. How? It's a tough game. They might be a little unlucky not to be rewarded. It was a fine tackle. Cox got his palm to it. Goulden, he's under close attention. Adams, Blakey, good build up. Nothing doing with the kick. They've given it back. Side bottom, boot to ball just in time. Dugowie, all on his own. Dacos, the Swans have been caught napping. Mitchell, he can put them in front and he does. These defenders are going to have to tighten up. They've been giving them way too much space. The Pies are really taking it to them today. Grundy palms it down. Adams, Parker. No one can mark. Mills. Ball spills free in the tackle. Murphy, ever reliable. Who will stand under that? Moving the footy laterally. Honours the lead. Goulden. Here's real danger now. Delivers it inside 50. Amati will take some stopping. Desperate defence. It's no place for the faint-hearted. He's suddenly a popular man. Into the middle with the kick. Lipinski, what a hand pass. Cox running in support. Can they find a late goal? Cunningham spoils. Mitchell, it's there! They took the right options of moving that ball forward and were able to take the opportunity when it presented. Both sides are cracking in hard at the present time. It's a great contest. Cox has been dominant in the ruck. Dugowie, crisp, strong grab. Some people can't kick that far. Lipinski for a three-goal game. It's there. They've pinched a break. Five consecutive goals, and the opposition seems powerless to stop them. The Swans really need to respond now. Grundy with a deft tap. Parker, Mills, dangerous to leave on his own. Might be time for one more score here. Heads towards goal, but the kick is astray. A minor score. That was a promising build-up and deserved a better finish. He's off. Quainor with the footy. Maynard works hard to present. Trying to get it out of the danger zone. Pendlebury read it well and claims the mark. That's the first half done and dusted, and we have been treated to a shootout. Let's hope it continues. What's happening down there, Gary? The Swans will be looking to improve their kicking efficiency and the quality of their forward 50 entries. They're getting their hands on the ball, but they're turning it over too frequently. It's all well and good to win the footy, but it's not a lot of use if you keep giving it back. We'll see how it plays out. Thanks, Gary.
Grundy gets his hand to it. Goulden. How? Didn't need to be asked twice. Keen to get this ball forward. Loy takes an excellent grab. I've liked his game today. Murphy spoils to Goey. The Pies are playing some great footy. No one can mark. Mills, Warner, Grundy with a chance to run. He's hit up the lead. Clever handball. That was almost handed to him. Terrific forward pressure. Dacos. You can see their confidence growing. And that's a letdown. No one can mark. Pendlebury was afforded latitude. They're playing with purpose and poise. Loy spoils. Goulden recognising the urgency. They must tidy up their kicking. Slick hands. Cox knew the tackle was coming. They're going nowhere and will have a stoppage near the centre. Good ruck work. Degoe. It's a hot footy. Dacos. He stopped in his tracks. Their ball movement has been impressive. It looks a well-oiled forward line. Will it roll through? That won't score. The Swans might be able to start something. Dacos trying to bring the Crummers into play. It's been a quality game so far. Lots of opportunities for both sides to hit the scoreboard. Grundy got his palm to it. Mills needs to be quick. McInerney lays it off. Warner up and under. They've turned it over. Incisive handball. Dacos can run and carry. The defenders will be nervous. No one can mark. Degoe. This will be another one. Oh, they can do no wrong. It's not for nothing the third quarter is known as the Premiership quarter. The Pies have got away. Grundy has rucked tirelessly. Goulden. That's a bit of a waste. Good tackle. Rowbottom gathers on the forward flank. McLean demanded the footy and got it. A question of accuracy, and he should be able to answer in the affirmative. They desperately need a goal. He should kick it. He hasn't kicked it. He really should have capitalised on that, but not to be. Away he goes. Quainor heads wide with the kick in. The Pies are bringing great energy. Grundy into the pocket he goes. Haywood cannot be deterred. He's got it. They've got to find a way to get him into the game. We know how damaging he can be. They've broken the run of goals at the other end, but they need a run of their own now. Grundy wins it. Rowbottom trying to find a path. Goulden. That was a brilliant tackle. Oh, they're hitting in hard. Grundy showing his skills. McInerney. Frampton gathers. Probing ball. Dacos. Clever kick. Cox has found some space. Farms it out. Murphy has a paddock in front of him. Pendlebury. They're looking good. McCreary can just about go all the way. Quality delivery by foot. I'll back him to drive this right through the high diddle diddle. Going at his second. Cox is hard to beat one on one. These half chances can often be the difference. Just waiting for the right moment to press go. He completely miscued that. His field kicking is normally first rate. He's generally a good kick. Blakey can keep it moving. Forced to go long down the line. Frampton went bang. Rowbottom. McInerney. Heaney was committed to the contest. Stoppage coming up on the wing. It's been a great duel between the two big men. Rowbottom, Grundy, well played. His vision was excellent. Kicking for his first. It's amounted to nothing. He's kicked it high. 
Murphy. Searching kick. Pendlebury. The Pies playing like winners. Side bottom. They're moving the footy well here. Pendlebury. Dacos in the right spot. Good hands. McCreary met solidly. It'll be a goal one way or another. That probably should have at least scored. Can he find a teammate? Rowbottom makes position. He hasn't been himself today. McAnooney goes long. Campbell sees something he likes. Goulden is wrapped up. Haywood under pressure. Dacos takes it on the halfback flank. Schiltz. They're moving the footy quickly. That passage of play promised more. They'll be disappointed. Can they get something going? Florence. McAnooney has a vice like grip. This is good ball movement. On the non preferred, Dacos spoils and will have a throw in. Gaz, what's caught your eye? The Swans are not out of this by any stretch of the imagination, but they do need to be cleaner with the footy. Crisp couldn't burst through. Mills, he's set upon. They ask the question, but the umpire will have it. The two big men do battle. Rowbottom, Goulden, can he get a kick away? Mills appreciates that delivery. Grundy had his name written all over. It'll take his best, but we've seen him do it before. Tries to bend this one back, but not enough. They might need to be more patient in constructing better shots at goal. He's off. Maynard to bring it in. The kick is precise. Cox with a chance to relieve the pressure. Quainor. Degoe. Normally delivers. Schiltz. Just has to hit a target. Punched away. Hill. Fighting tooth and nail not to give up a goal. Takes the responsibility. Just needs to finish. Finish he does. He's finally on the score sheet. He's been quiet today, but he made that one count. Out to a 20-point margin. Punch clear. Dacos. Ineffective disposal. Cox snares the loose ball. Crisp uses the body well. This would be a great goal if he can kick it. Going at his second. Grundy taking no chances. Gets it to safety. Blakey tasked with the kick in. Good work rate. Plays the percentages. Frampton with the big fist and out of play. Gaz, what's caught your eye? The Pies have made some mistakes, but they haven't been deterred. They just keep creating opportunities. Grundy looking for territory. Mills, Rowbottom, Goulden. Good handball. Warner. Inside 50 with the kick. Punched away. McAnooney. That won't make the distance. Maynard spoils. And finally over the line. Quainor heads wide with the kick in. Maynard all on his own. Murphy got to the right position and hung on. Pendlebury, good looking kick. Mitchell goes back with the handball. They can smell victory. Outbodies his opponent and took a ripper. That's not a mark. The distance is the only problem. It's dropped short, but it matters not. That was great use of the body. He's so hard to beat in those situations. It's there. Marks inside 50 and work their way in goal when you go back and convert the goal. The Swans are on the precipice. They desperately need to ignite. Cox wins it. He's caught. Parker popped up out of nowhere. Heaney has a way of drawing the footy. He's been striking them well. This shouldn't present any problems. Heads towards goal and does not let them down. 
I want to get it in his hands as much as I can with finishing like that. The Swans have been outplayed, but they're hanging tough. Rucks go at it. That's a bruising tackle. Mills, McAnooney rolling the sleeves up. He's gone. Rowbottom. How is calm in a crisis. Blasts away. Rampy wins it back. Great mark. Doesn't often waste it. Amati all alone in the centre square. The aerialist will battle for this ball. McLean. They sorely need a goal. And he delivers. They might want to tighten up on him. They gave him too much space on that occasion. And he made the most of it. The Swans have closed to within three kicks. Cox wins it out of the centre. Rowbottom. What's he got on offer? Maynard spoils. Amati, terrific tackle. McLean, it's a goal. That's two. He's causing the plenty of headaches down there. The Swans have had a great patch. Good ruck work. Dacos, can he hit a target? Chris, at centre half forward. That's almost worth a kick. Side bottom. Going at his first, and he's got it. It eases the pressure on the forwards when you have midfielders chipping in. The Pies are holding them at bay. Grundy wins the hit out. Parker, Haywood, delightfully done. He just dropped it. It's no place for the faint-hearted. Side bottom gets to it first. Schiltz, was that a legal disposal? Row bottom gets back and should repel. No one can mark. Frampton, it's a hot footy. Umpire's ball as we near three-quarter time. Grundy with a deft tap. Mills on the same page as his ruck. Frampton gathers. Chris desperate to win it back. Cox. Rampy got to the fall. Ignoring the corridor for now. Lloyd. A good kick here and they'll be in business. Mills on centre wing has marked. This ought to end in a goal. They need a mark. Defence 101 there. McLean. Looking to pull one back, and that's exactly what he's done. Well played. Five goals for the quarter, and these forwards are certainly earning their money. That was a huge goal in the shadows of three-quarter time. Important clearance here. Rowbottom needing support. Haywood, Grundy, Mills. The defence is disorganised, punched away. Pendlebury wins a hard ball. He's under close attention and they're out of trouble. Dacos leading from the front. The Pies looking ominous. Good disciplined defence. Blakey, he stopped in his tracks. Hamlin, Hill runs onto it. Dacos, it's a tough game. Markov, he's going for home. And why wouldn't he with a finish like that? That's what happens when you leave players in space inside 50. It's going to hurt you on the scoreboard. So the underdog throwing down the gauntlet. You can see their belief growing. We'll turn for home with this match firmly in the balance. A cracking final quarter coming up. Gary's back. What's caught your eye, Gaz? The Swans. We'll be very confident that they can run over the top here. They pride themselves on their fitness and being a good fourth quarter team. So this will be a great test for them. If they get the first goal, they might be hard to stop. I'm inclined to agree. Thank you, Gaz. <laughs> Grundy with the tap. How will the umpire see this? Rowbottom. Papley gets his kick despite the heat. Good thinking and good execution too. It's not a gimme goal, but certainly one that should be kicked. He's already got one. Now he's got two. 
Their efficiency in front of the sticks has arguably kept them in this game. The Swans were up to the first, and they've got it. Big clearance to win here. Dacos, crunching tackle, kicks to half forward. Warner went bang. He's suddenly a popular man. Touch and go. Accuracy in front of goal is so important, particularly in a close game. Blakey to bring it in. Quality delivery by foot. Penetrating ball. Goulden. Good kick. Mills by hand. He'll feel that one. No way through there and they'll reset. It's been a great duel between the two big men. He'll be sore in the morning. Grundy. They're a big chance here. Well played. It's so important to be efficient in front of goal, especially when it's tied on the scoreboard. Heaney is the man for the moment. He's the man for the moment. He's kept them in it. Just a pity he hasn't had more support. You can't help but feel this one's going down to the final minute. Cox showing his skills. Rowbottom. That's not 15. Haywood. The Swans have been gallant. Packle. They've worked it well. He'll give them the lead if he can hold his nerve. Set sail for home. And he is delivered. He hasn't had a big impact, but he's still found a way to kick a couple. Still anyone's game. Cox wins it down. Dacos. They could be in front in a minute. Chris, that one was always his. What's he got for us? Nothing to lose. Set the match. He's got one already. Will this be number two? Punched away. Danger averted. Frantic defense. Blakey heads wide with the kick in. Cunningham has found some space. He might have thought about the corridor. You can't afford to do that too often. That's skillful. No one can mark, and they see it out. Lots to analyse, Gaz. What stands out? The Pies are getting smashed in the clearances. A couple of their midfielders have been well down and must lift. Robot, Mills, under pressure. This spells trouble. A bit of friendly fire. To give them the lead, he's done it. You turn the ball over there, you've got to expect to pay the price. We've got a great contest. Hope you're enjoying it at home. The big men fly. Side bottom. Quick kick towards centre half forward. Chris marks. Will he go the bomb? Cox. It's a goal. He managed to find some space in a dangerous position and made them pay for their loose checking. Neither side giving an inch. What a contest we're seeing. The two big men do battle. Parker, shucks it. Mills, great play. McLean demanded the footy and got it. Haywood is the man on the spot and is marked. Can he deliver? Yeah, back him more often than not. Kicks for goal. It's a lovely looking kick. He's drawn it. So important to get reward for effort. On that occasion, the finish matched the quality of the work upfield. It's a good old fashioned arm wrestle. Cameron with the tap. Dugowie kicks inside the forward 50. McCreary, Schiltz. He's got it! If they can get up ahead of steam, they'll be hard to stop. That was a terrific passage of play, culminating in a great goal. The Pies are keeping them at arm's length. Rowbottom, he's got support. Parker, an ill-directed hand pass. Met solidly. Sidebottom, kicks inside the forward 50. Who's front and centre? Florence feeds it out. Hamlin. 
The Swans might be in a spot of bother. Needs that to come back. It's a gift, really, and he's taken full advantage. It's a handy buffer they've established. Cameron with the tap. Side bottom. Can they get another one? Hamlin is there to save the day. The clock is the enemy now. Cunningham, great body work. The Pies have denied them the corridor. Florence can keep it moving. He doesn't waste many. McAdoo. Can he be the fire starter? Haywood heads towards half four. Inside 50 with the kick. That's great footy. Maybe he could have gone himself. Heaney is hard to beat one on one. He hasn't looked like missing so far, so I'll back him in here. Goes for the check side. Yes, that is so skillful. Five strike for him now. He's been deadly accurate. The goals are coming thick and fast. This is great to watch. Cox, the winner there. Degoe, he's besieged. Crisp, that's a bruising tackle. Markov, he ran into a brick wall. Who's at home? McCartan, making his claim for the Golden Fist Award. The kick was centimetre perfect. And they're away. Parker. Going for territory. No one can mark. Quainor, caught, dropped it like a hot potato. Howe, saw that coming. Parker, intercepts on centre wing. He's hit up the lead. Happy to be patient and wait for an opening. Warner, the Swans, moving the ball well. Towards the boundary line. Seizes the moment. Heads for the pocket. Moore, wins the contest and can relieve the pressure. A chance to clear now. Frampton, Quainor. Out of the congestion. Side bomb. It's no place for the faint-hearted. The Swans will have one eye on the clock. Cox has rucked tirelessly. Mills. Rowbottom. Parker. The distance is the only problem. He's got it. On the board with his first. That'll build his confidence. This is a ding-dong battle. Both sides unrelenting in their attack on the footy. Dugowie. Thought his way through it. Chris at centre half forward. Sweeping handball. It's there! They've got five for the corner now, and there's time for more, too. The Pies have got the margin back beyond a goal. Rucks go at it. Good ruck work and good roving too. Will the umpire pluck a free kick? Frampton puts his head over it. Dacos. That passage of play promised more. They'll be disappointed. The Pies guarding the corridor. Warner working hard and presenting well. It's a high ball. Howe spoils. Haywood picking their way through. Murphy is like the rock of Gibraltar. What can they generate? Good work rate. Pendlebury. Bit of a nothing kick. Dacos sees an opportunity and plays on. Closed him down. The crowd cries, ball, and they get their wish. On is the lead. Crosses the paint. No one can mark. Mills, solid tackle. They want ball, but they're not going to get it. Cox had his measure today. Cops some unwanted attention. He can smell a goal from a long way off, but his kick is astray. The Pies can't fall into the trap of trying to save the game. They need to keep taking it on. Quainor to bring it back in. Frampton all on his own. He's got an option in the centre square. Thumped away. Parker. That's poor play. Stripped of it. Grundy. Haywood. Dangerous to leave on his own. He hasn't missed yet. Can he keep a clean sheet? Drop punt. That'll be a goal. Never in doubt. Confidence is a wonderful thing, and he's playing with plenty. Another clinical finish there. One kick game again. 
Important clearance here. Side bottom. Can they turn back the tide? Dacos with a chance to send it forward. Cox commands the footy for a little breathing space. Looks good off the boot. He's got it. He has produced a clinical finish there to cap off a terrific passage of play. The Pies with a bit of breathing space now. Grundy with the tap. Parker, he's run into trouble. Papley, can he finish it off? This will be a goal. Through it goes. And there's a kick the difference. Neither team is able to string goals together or generate any meaningful momentum. It's an engrossing battle. The Swans have got it back to three points. Goulden needs a good decision. Haywood. Throws it on the boot. Moore tries to spike it out of the danger zone. And a moment for the players to catch their breath. What are your thoughts, Gaz? The Swans aren't getting much value out of their clearance dominance. And that can be very deflating. Mills. Snap around the body. It's there! That's number nine for the quarter. They've been relentless and ruthless. And they might not be done yet. Yet another lead change. And who would know where it's going to end? Grundy showing his skills. Parker, so influential today. Delivers it inside 50. Haywood has marked in front of goal. A goal here will shut the door on them. The distance is the only problem. No one can mark. Happy to concede it behind. He's off. Maynard with the footy. The kick is precise. Good thinking and good execution too. That might attract a pack. Parker spoils. And out it goes. Gaz, what have you noticed down at ground level? The Swans probably haven't taken full advantage of how much ball they've had. They really should be further in front. Big clearance to win here. Goulden, McInerney, Frampton gets in the way. Cyborg comes free in the tackle. Mills, Greg Williams has been proud of that one. The Swans finishing strongly. Murphy saves the day. Can they keep the footy this time? What can they muster from the back half? That's a good option, and this looks promising. To go in, they'll bide their time. Murphy has found some space. It's a high kick, a real rainmaker. Blakey lumbering after it. Mills, that'll go close to the line. Warner. Delivers it inside 50. Maynard clears the area. Papley, how will the umpire see this? Goes goal, and he's off target. Seemed like the defenders got a bit lost there, and they're lucky not to give up a goal. Away he goes. They need to go coast to coast. He's got under that one. Schiltz. Some indirect ball movement here. Frampton, that'll work. Goes very wide. Dacos. Finally, they go inside 50. It's a poor entry, a waste really. Kicks laterally, the Swans are out of trouble. Campbell has found some space at halfback. Can they find a late goal? McInerney. Tumbles a putt towards the boundary line. How spoils. Grundy with a death tap. Goulden, McInerney, he's set upon. The Pies have to be clean here. Time is of the essence. It's been a great duel between the two big men. The Swans look to be coming home strong. Haywood, it's there! Well, if it wasn't over before, it is now. The Swans are doing enough to keep their noses in front. Cameron slaps it out. Degoe, he's under close attention. Dacos marks. Will he go the bomb? He's got two already. It's dropped short, but it matters not. This to keep them alive and set up a grandstand finish.
The Pines will be very disappointed by this result. They'll feel they should have won today, but it wasn't to be. On behalf of Daniel Hartford, Gary Lyon, and myself, Anthony Hudson, thanks for your company. We'll catch you again soon.